Welcome back to another video. I'm back with another lucky Jack of Box video. Unboxing video. So if you watched my last video, you noticed today that I'm still wearing the same clothes. Because I said I was going to do two videos. I'm going to do the Rod Arsenal, which you, you just you should have watched. Go, if you haven't watched it, go back and watch my last video. And then doing a lucky Jack of Box video because of the weather today. So let's go ahead and get into this unboxing video. So, let's see here. Find the old, the old ad cards and everything. We got a stickle. You know, stickles are cool. We got a bait mate, fish tracking stickle. Uh, and then we have a fishing guide. Yeah, it's, well, you know, it's got some good reading in there. Oh, and I guess that's where the bait cord is now. So let's go ahead and dive into this box, you know. Alright, so the first one on this little plant book, this little magazine, it says the backstabble squirrel bill. There's the squirrel bill. So this crankbait, I like this color actually, it's a really good color. There's something different about this crankbait. I've never, I've never fished a crankbait like this. I don't think I've ever seen a crankbait like this, to be honest with you. So, here's the color, right? It's a good looking color, good shadow looking color, but the hook is on the back end of that. Like this, on the top side, like this is the way it swims, right? The hook is on top. And I was reading on it a little bit because I did open this box. I'm not gonna lie, I did open this box and look through it. And it's supposed to minimize, you know, getting hung up and stuff. And another cool thing I thought about, I don't know if hooks Another cool thing about this, I thought when the fish bites on this, that hook will go on the top of the mouth instead of the bottom of the mouth. And that'll help you out in some of your, uh, some of the uh, hookups. And I thought that was pretty neat on that big deal. You know, I didn't read all of this, but I don't see price on these baits anymore. Let's go over look No, I don't see price on these baits anymore. I'm probably, I'm probably overlooking it. Anyways, let's get, let's just keep on moving here. And see the next bait. Strike King bait. For a Strike King half shell. It's a little drop shot bait. Let me pull that, pull one out of the package. Yeah, a little drop shot bait. Look at that like green pumpkin color drop shot bait. Not bad. It's got a little unique tail design on it. I'll have to give that a try. If you noticed my last video, I didn't say I, I don't fish a lot with with uh, finesse stuff, so might give it a try. I'm not gonna lie, we might not, but if we come in a situation I need to drop shot bait, I know I've got one. Alright, let's go to the next bait. It's like we got a Dobbins spindle bait. So a Dobbins D Blade Advantage. Now I like spinner baits. Not the half ounce spinner bait. Good white and chartreuse color. I like that actually. Let's see if you got anything cool about it. Special hook capo trailers, custom head colors, mustache needle point hook. I like I actually like that, you know. That looks like a barbell or sweater in it. I like that one. I'm not gonna open the package yet, but I like that one. That one comes helpful. Hopefully, when the water gets warmed up, hopefully this one will come in handy. I really like that. Next, we got an X Zone Lures Muscle Back Crawl. Looks like that'd be it. Yeah, right that looks like almost a tiny bit like a tiny finesse crawl. But I do like that one crawl. This would be really good on the back of a jig, actually. Really, I like that color too. It's like, like a green pumpkin. Really good on like a small finesse jig or something like that. I really like that one. This one will probably, de I would definitely use this one. And I really like that. Cool. Got some crawls in this box. Awesome. Always, always need more crawls. That's always the number one thing. You never know. You might be Texas rigging them, or you might be putting on the back of the jig. I'll probably put that one on the back of the jig, to be honest with you. So, let's move on to the next one. We got a reaction strike, reaction buzz. We got a buzz bait. 
Oh, another white and chartreuse pattern. Uh, that's actually my favorite color for a, a top one. I like white and chartreuse. Absolutely honest with you. And it's a single blade, blade one, so actually not too bad. I actually like that a little bit. Uh, let's see. It's not a bit. Doesn't say what size it is unless I'm overlooking somewhere. Oh, 3 8 ounce. 3 8 ounce buzz bait. That's awesome. Good one to have, especially when the water starts getting warm. Alright, let's go to the next one here. Alright. Looks so like we got a net, pay, net bait packer crawl. And I'm gonna say something now. I love the net bait packer chunks, the one that goes on the back of jigs. All of my trailers for jigs are net bait. I just, I love, I, I just love the action. And this is one another good color that I like to It's actually a sun perch. And like I said, you always need more cross. No matter if you want a Texas rig, wiggle, it should be a one off probably Texas rig. Or if you're going to put them on the back of, you know, the jig. Uh, sun patch, sun port color, I like that one actually. Pretty good looking, pretty good looking bait. I actually, I, I love net baits crawls. One of my favorite crawls to throw uh, on the back of a jig. Now, a lot of times I'll, I'll throw like a, a no chicken cross up in Texas made, but that one would be the next one I would throw for sure. I would for sure throw that. Alright, doesn't say it. Yeah, I guess this is this a, a gift. I got a pack of uh, Daiichi hooks, the three R hooks in them. Uh, it does, but it doesn't say you know. It doesn't show that I have them. I'm overlooking them. Doesn't say I'm supposed to get them in the little pamphlet though. But anyways, I got a pack of hooks. If you don't know what Lucky Jack Box is, it's a it's a subscription based product. You know, it's like ordering a ma ordering a magazine every month, and you get you know a box every month for baits, for good baits. Um, you got you know crawls, buzz baits, spinner baits. You know, you got hooks to go along with that, crank baits. Uh, yeah, so I'll go ahead and link Lucky Tax down in the, in the description below. Uh, go check them out, especially if you're new to fishing. It helps you get baits. But like these things, he'll they even tell you how to use them. And you can go to the YouTube channel and they'll tell you how to use these baits. Uh, and for me, it gets me baits sometimes that I wouldn't ever throw. Like especially like this backstabber crank bait. If I saw that in the store, I'd be like, oh. Cool color pattern. Let me go see if I can find it in, a, in, in like a normal crankbait. Cause I would, I wouldn't throw something like that. But, but you know, it gets me to the point where, you know, make it a challenge. You know, and yet I know I've not posted an LCB slam challenge. I need to. But like I said in my last video, today's weather has been crazy. It went from like 60 degrees to like 29 in a matter of like 30 minutes. So today was crazy on the weather so once the weather starts warming up i'll definitely take some of these baits out and give them a try and probably like make it a challenge like an ltv slam or something like that uh so we'll see how that works out um you know i, I might even take some of the boxes i haven't got to fish yet um because it's been so the weather been so good i might take some of those out and even do those uh, anyways i really guys hope you guys like this video i know it's not fishing i know it, it's holding me too Fishing is right around the season, right around the corner, especially for the people down south. I believe Texas, they're catching you know, some big bass already. Uh, you northern people, you're probably still frozen up though, so I don't know. Good luck with the rest of those eyes. Uh, anyways, I hope you guys like this video, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. And always remember, go out, have some fun, catch some fish.